Hey everyone, welcome back to The Hidden Brick, where today we're building the LEGO Nexo Knights Ultimate Flama, or Flama, how do you say it? How do you say that? Flama or Flama? Flama. I'm going to say Flava, because it's a flame. The, the, the figure is a someone on fire. So uh, this is set number 7033967 pieces. Of course we get the three Nexo Power tiles, and this is the final one that I'm building from the second wave of the Ultimate Nexo Knight figures. Go ahead and slice that open. And dump out the contents. There we go. So, got two bags of parts and we got a single instruction book that's folded in half. So there's a big bag of parts, and here's our small bag. Okay. So, what do we always begin with? Obviously, the minifigure. So, we have the little ghostly flame piece for the legs. Then, we have the torso part. Next, we're going to build part of the backpack slash weapon. It goes into this piece that has the neck bracket, so that's when it, it's going to go on the torso. Okay, so we just slide that right over the torso neck bracket. We put the creepy flaming head on there. And it's got this really cool flame piece that goes right over the the minifigure head. And then right here we're gonna attach little accessory piece. A lightsaber handle with a flaming sword. And then we have our Nexo shield with the Flaming Nexo tile on there. Alright. Not quite done yet. We're gonna build a little hammer piece. So we take these trans orange two by two round. Attach all that. There's a printed flame tile. Turn it over. We have this cool little rubbery spike piece. You can see it's kind of a, a flexible, hard rubber. It's not very soft, but it's supposed to go in there. Doesn't quite fit all the way in there. And then that goes there. So you can see <clears throat> this little gear when you hold it and turn it. It kind of creates this cool little hammer action. Alright, so now, time for our weapons rack. Oh, a little bit closer. Jumper tiles go on a little bit different because the bottom of that, those ghost legs, actually connect differently than a standard minifigure's legs will. That goes there. So we've built enough of these, we kind of know what where everything's going. 
jumping ahead a few steps before I move on to the next one. these bionicle fingers with a little clip on them. That'll give us a spot to connect the weapons to. So now we have a stud launcher gun. It's going to have the green, kind of fluorescent green, neon green, whatever you want to call it. We've got the little tile that looks like a slime ball. And this crate is what we will hold our extra ammo. Oops. That one's gone forever. There's an extra one anyway. They only showed us putting three in there. Alright, so this piece is one of these little Ninjago little Try bar pieces. It creates a triangle shape. You can see we connect these rubbery spike pieces. So that goes there with our Nexo tile here. And it's cool, they give us a couple extras. So we have an extra white and an extra black one. Alright. Put Flama right there. There we go. So that completes the build. And like I said, the extra pieces, you can uh, switch out the, the blade for the stud launcher or for the little ninja throwing star looking piece. So very good, That's uh, that completes all of the ultimate Lego Nexo Knights. So uh, if you like this, make sure to check all the other ones out. We have a Nexo Knights playlist that has all of our Nexo Knights videos on there. So if you love these, then check them all out, and we will see you in the next one.